All right, so today we're up here in Scalcohol area. We're going to Fuse Lake. It is the morning. We figured it'd be a great way to start our Sunday. And it's gorgeous out. It's a little cold, but that's the way it runs. The almighty beautiful Fuse Lake. Soldier's about to take a swim. All right, so we made our way to the top of the lake. This is Fuse Lake. Um, it's up Skagaho Pass. It is gorgeous. Just take a peek at this. Wow. Very much cliff jumpable, but in my opinion, it's way too cold out in this year to go cliff jumping. But I think Coulter was gonna do it. Coulter? Oh, I mean, if you do it, I'll do it. Well, you heard it there first. We got Dad all the way down there, just showing some perspective. Papa Scott, and we're up here. Oh. Cut. So we're gonna make our way back down. It was a beautiful hike. We just wanted to get a morning hike in. What are your thoughts, Pops? It was awesome. It was awesome. Coulter? We need to come back. We do need to come back. This is one definitely that would be an awesome place just to camp and hang out all day in a summer summer day with that cliff. It's gorgeous. There's great fishing up here. There's grayling. You can actually catch the grayling up here. And it's awesome. We're gonna make our way back down the hill and see where this day takes us. So follow along. Three days later. All right, it's been a couple days since I went on that hike. Um, sadly, I just had no other footage to complete that vlog. But today is a beautiful day, and we're gonna make some more footage. Starting news of the vlog: got something really awesome in the mail. It's a sprocket guard, so it goes on my sprocket, so I can start not damaging my sprocket like I have been on uh, Oppo grinds or anything like that. So I'm really stoked on that. That is hype. Can't tell you how. I'm how exciting that is. Got the Pathfinder, of course, because you know, gotta support the boys, Felix Prangenberg. The other awesome thing we got, let's find out. I ordered this, like yesterday, two days ago, and it ripped down here. Super stoked. This is awesome stuff, guys. I'm really excited to show you. And a magic card, Adventurous Impulse. Drew sent me a magic card in my package. Thank you, Drew. We're gonna hang that up on the wall. We'll do that later though. So, what, what I got today in the mail was a beautiful t-shirt. Absolutely stunning. See if you can make that out. I'm stoked. This is gonna be so rad. Beautiful art. So my buddy's a musician, Drew Danbury. Um, I'll link his channel down below. Definitely go check him out. He's way cool. Makes like the coolest things ever. They released uh, a new album. Uh, I believe it was. So yeah, they released a new album, Icarus Phoenix. It is awesome. It's on Bandcamp. The link will also be down below for that. Definitely check it out because it is great music. It's a great friend. He supports. He's the coolest guy ever. Got that dope t-shirt. Dope, I'm telling you. That thing's dicey. Then we actually got some stickers. Some Drew Danbury stickers. We got, let's see. There's some Telos tape ones. They're beautiful. Uh, let's see. The I think it's probably the prettiest one. It's just that art of the t-shirt. I love that. Um, and just some more just tell us tapes, which is just what they do. Beautiful. We even got some nice emoticons. A beautiful print. Some codes. And then Adventure's Impulse, because adventure is where life is to be had. I love it. Um, I definitely have a couple extra stickers from this, so if you see me at the park, 
and you saw this, and you proved to me that you listened to like one of Drew's songs or anything of nature, or you got something, definitely let me know, and I'll hook you up with some stickers because they're sick. But you definitely got to prove to me that you listened to the new album. And yeah, it's, it's kind of excited about the sprocket guard because I have been dinging up my sprocket. Like I'll I'll show you a clip after this of just how worn out it's been getting. So. I got this. I actually even ordered a new sprocket and a pair of handlebars, but the website seller um, gypsed me again. It was like with my frame, it's the same exact seller. They don't ship the thing for like two weeks, and then when the, the eBay day comes, I'm like, hey guys, where's my stuff? It's like, oh, we didn't have it. It's like, I'm like, you couldn't have told me two weeks earlier and waste my time. So I go, totally got gypsed again on eBay. Really, really bugs me, really bumps me out. But we got a sprocket guard, so it's pretty solid. Pretty, pretty, pretty steezy, bars. But yeah, um, currently, it's 11 o'clock. I'm supposed to meet Cody to go play Frisbee at 12 o'clock, but I really want to go bike. So we're going to see how I can squeeze my time in. Nonetheless, let's go figure out what happens. So, it's like really windy out. I mean like, the scooter kids are taking flight. They're getting whooshed out of there. And then the leaves are everywhere and we're sliding around. It's a deadly war zone out here at the skate park today. But we're gonna keep shredding it. 